are just about ready to get underway here in game two of the first round of the Western Conference playoffs. 2K Sports brings it to you live once again. And on tap tonight, it's the Golden State Warriors going up against the Denver Nuggets. I'm Kevin Harlan, joined by the talented analyst tandem of Greg Anthony and Chris Weber. David Aldridge is on our sideline. D.A., take it away. Nuggets coach Mike Malone is the son of longtime NBA assistant coach Brenda Malone, who was on the staff with the late Chuck Daly in Detroit when the Pistons won back-to-back -back NBA titles. Malone's dad told him not to get into coaching with its nomadic lifestyle and volatility. Michael said, I knew the pitfalls. My father said, all right, if you're going to be a coach, be a great coach. If you have a passion, you've got to follow that passion. Kevin? That's some pretty sound advice. Thanks, D.A. Now let's take a look at Denver's opening lineup. The backcourt is Murray and Harris. At the forward slots, it's Barton and Milson. And it's Jokic in at the five down low. And for Golden State, Curry and Clay, the Splash Brothers, in the backcourt. Green and Cauley Stein are down low. And it's Robinson in at the three slot. And it's the Warriors to start out. Green finds Robinson. Now here's Cauley Stein. Martin defending. Passes it to Thompson. Down to five on the shot clock. Pass to Green. Over Harris. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. Murray against Curry. Inside. Here's Millsap. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. That's not who they want guarding him. I mean, the size mismatch is just too big. All he has to do is just keep attacking the rim. On its way from Curry for two, and it's off the back rim. No good. Golden opportunity that he can't make good. Maybe a wake-up call to the D, though. They can't leave him alone like that. Now, here's Jokic. A pass to Harris. Shot clock at six. Back to Jokic. It is good, the assist from Harris. Well, you can learn a lot by watching him operate in their offense. And it's Thompson with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Warriors. Four-point game. Outside curve. And the three ball is good. Oh, that's a drop in the ball from Mr. Curry. One of the softest three-point shots you'll ever see. He'll step up top. Barton outside. And Thompson sends it back. Oh, he hasn't been much of a shot blocker in his career, but Clay denies that. That's the curve. Back to Thompson from deep three point range. Paul Millsap with the rebound. Poke loose and stolen by Coley Stein. And here they go. And there's Stephen Curry on the assist by Thompson. Curry's got five points so far. Oh, that's a great pass by Thompson. You see the skill, the craft, and he's a depth of finding this guy. Harris up top. He's covered by Thompson. Harris passes to Millsap. Five on the clock. Right open look here for Murray. And another miss by Denver. A little surprised he took the jump shot with nobody around him. He could have attacked the basket. Robinson passes to Green. Shoots over Barton. And it's Green missing. Now you can't look at the result of that shot. They'll take that whenever they get it. You're exactly right. I mean, that's the kind of shot you're trying to work for at the offensive. And Jokic wide open. He shoots. Bangs home the trifecta. Five points in the game. Boy, he is looking confident. Love how they're using him so far. Yeah, that's because he's getting this number called early. I mean, he's doing his part to help carry the offensive load. 
And the Warriors decide to take their first time out here. Adjustments are a part of the game, and the coach sees something he doesn't like here. Yeah, I, I like the chess match that's going on here. Each team trying to find and, and exploit the favorable matchup on the floor. Von Looney is checked in for Cauley Stein. Alfonso McKinney comes in for Robinson. Alec Burks checked in for Thompson. And it's Russell in for Curry. Green. And Grant sends it back. They get it back. Looney with the bucket. Here's Morris. Denver with the triple. And he likes to get in a rhythm early. Nice triple. And it's Russell with the ball. He'll bring it up for Golden State. They trail by three. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. And this is why you like size in the backcourt. Russell taking the hit, yet still able to finish. Back to Morris. 21 left to play in the first quarter. Outside Porter. Three pointer. It's hauled in by McKinney. Golden State's gone 102 from long range in the first quarter. Denver's gone two or three from deep so far in this game. Here's Porter. Comes up empty down low. The Warriors have gone four of ten shooting the ball here in the first quarter. Russell, no luck. Not quite enough defense. That time around, just lucky he was off. Morris passes to Porter. And the athleticism and size of Porter creates problems for the defense. Hard to guard without getting physical. The Nuggets shooting their first free throws of the game. First one falls for yeah, a former five-star recruit. We know about the talent level with Porter, but he's also a mature, hard-working guy. And Porter drops them both. Oh, he's such a good free-throw shooter. I mean, it frees him up to be as aggressive as he wants in the post. McKinney kicks it to Looney. Morris against Russell. Golden State needs to get off a shot. Here's Green. The rebound by Grant. Old quarter for him. Ice cold. I mean, it may be time to give him a breather. Maybe someone off the bench can give him a spot. Burks looking around. Fires for three. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. And still a close game as the first quarter comes to a close. Nuggets lead by three. It's the NBA on 2K Sports from San Francisco. the great Golden State Warrior scores. Draymond Green spoke about feeding the hot hand. I think there are times where one of the guys need to take more shots and sometimes to where we can be a little bit too unselfish. You know, if one guy thinks, hey man, I'm taking too many shots, let me get someone else involved. But if you got it going, we all want you to shoot. Yeah, why not? Green knows that, Greg, if, if you're in the zone, keep firing. And with his unselfishness and vision, Green, more often than not, is the one setting the table. 
And glad to have you with us as we get going here in game two. And the Nuggets, guys, what jumps out to you, numbers one? You, you got to credit their defense, communicating, rotating, making plays on the ball. No question. It's been stifling thus far, preventing that offense from establishing any kind of rhythm. So on the floor for Denver, it's Morris and Beasley at the one and the two. Only out there with Jeremy Grant, and it's Porter in at the three. Now, here is Morris. He's got five. The shot is good. And so is his shooting tonight. Three for four. Pick works well there. Not much resistance from the D. It's a lazy effort. Let's just be honest. Hoping the shooter misses. That doesn't constitute defense. Yeah, that's two bombs in a row from long range. Timeout is called. First of the game for the Nuggets. Changes here for the Warriors. Cauley Stein, he's checked in for Draymond Green. Clay Thompson comes in for Alfonso McKinney. And Curry subbed in for Burks. Now here's Murray. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Passes it to Jokic. Over Cauley Stein. And it's Jokic missing. And it's Thompson with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Golden State Warriors. They trail by one. The defense a step slow. You can see the result. Murray kicks to Barton. Curry against Murray. It's Barton on the wing. Addition out to Millsap. Misses from close range. A fantastic effort on D to get up in his face and deny the layup. Russell from long range. Denver grabs the miss. They come into this game after losing on Saturday. Yeah, I mean, their execution at times was flawless, but they also made some mistakes that ultimately did them in. Tough to win games like that on the road, even with all the great work they did. Here's Curry following the basket by Jokic. Curry gets the bucket. Curry's got the lead up to two now for the Warriors. I mean, that's good as soon as he leaves his fingers. I mean, he's not going to miss from there. Jokic with it, and Curry picks him up defensively, and that one's good. No chef. Well, it was just a mystery what the defense was doing there. You never want to give him that much space outside the three-point line. Curry on the wing. He's covered by Murray. Looney. Yet again, and it's sent back by Millsap. And Millsap with great hands and the anticipation there to block the shot. And here's Harris from the arc. Cauley Stein grabs the ball. Warriors have gone four of seven from the field in this second quarter so far. It's Curry that time on the assist by Russell. And that's 13 points for Steph Curry. And they're getting their points now almost exclusively from the triple. Four of their last five mates are from beyond the other. And he's an automatic finisher when he gets into that area. He is, and he picks the simple one-hand stuff to get the two points. Timeout called the Warriors.
change here. Robinson's checked in. Golden State's gone 5 and 10 from downtown tonight. 50% exactly. Here's Curry with the three. An absolute bomb from three point range. Curry's got 11 points in the quarter. Murray against Curry. Releases. That one's in there. The Warrior lead is cut to just one on the basket for Murray. Golden State's gone 6 of 11 when they've taken the three point shot tonight. Very respectable. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. Paul Millsap picks one up. It's hard to believe that some teams passed on Curry in the 2009 draft. I mean, this guy is the total package. He has a winner's mentality. And he knocks down the first one. And some changes here for the Warriors. Alfonso McKinney is checked in for Kavon Looney. And Alec Burks subbed in for Clay Thompson. The Nuggets also changing it up. Mason Plumley's checked in for Millsap. Jeremy Grant comes in for Barton. And it's Beasley in for Gary Harris. Stephen Curry hits them both. Oh, not many players with the more steady hand at the free throw line than this fellow. Murray, the pass to Plumley. Back to Murray. We've got 123 left in the second quarter. Something that's kept this game close is the fact that the rebound stats for both teams are almost identical. And he comes up with the deuce. Curry's got the lead up to five now for the Warriors. Now, I thought maybe the team was kicking him out as the game went along. Looks like he's kicking them out in this first half. Outside for Murray. Back to Jokic. Five to shoot. Easily for three. But they'll get another chance. A second chance effort. And that one's good. Jokic. Jokic has got 11 points. There's 39 seconds left in the first half. Two for one. Probably the way to go. Uh, yes, yeah. I imagine that's what they're thinking. You have to maximize the possession. He doesn't get the finish, but the D's got to be quicker to rotate and stop him from getting to the rim. And Murray. Here we go. That's in. He's got two made now, and he's shooting two for three. They're consistently finding ways to get the ball inside and taking full advantage. Curry against Murray. From deep. Doesn't go for him. It's been all about Stephen Curry for the Golden State Warriors. His production has been flowing as he's tallied 20 points and looks to be planning for more. And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much, Steph. I know Coach Stress is taking care of the basketball. What have you guys been doing to make sure you limit your turnovers? I mean, you look at film, but it's just about in-game situations, just analyzing the situation and take care of the ball. Um, making sure that you make eye contact with the passes. And, um, you know, sometimes getting a shot up is better than giving it to them. So we got to just look at that and, and figure it out. Yeah, when you don't turn the ball over, you have a chance to score, right? Congratulations. Back to you, Kevin. Thanks so much, Dave, for the great interview. Don't go away, folks. We'll be back for the second half of basketball right after this. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello again, everybody. Halfway through this round one matchup of the NBA playoffs, Ernie Johnson, Kenny Smith, and Shaq. Well, for the Warriors, getting out to a 2-0 lead in the series would mean so much to them. And it looks like this game could go down to the wire trying to achieve that goal. This game is definitely still up for grabs, the way these two teams are battling. Taking a look at the Warriors, Kenny, what'd you think? Well, the three-point shooting was the key thus far. When you're knocking down those shots from the perimeter, it really spreads the floor. You demand respect from the defense. We'll see if they can keep it flowing in the second half. And big fellow, let's get your thoughts on the Nuggets. They ran their offense very well in the first half. There were almost no four shots. It was good, smart basketball. The motion in their offense was terrific. They made those defenders work very hard. I like what I saw from them for the most part. And that's all we have for now. Tell the folks goodbye, Shaq. Tell the folks goodbye, goodbye. Kenny. Goodbye. Let's go to Kevin Harlan. And we're happy.
happy to have you back for more playoff basketball here in round one. Really an incredible game from Stephen Curry. You, you just love the patience in that first half. Waited until he got the look that he wanted. Yeah, working the ball, getting clean, quality looks. I mean, just efficient basketball through and through. Well, it doesn't get much better than playoff basketball. Let's get back to the action here in round one. Green and Cauley Stein are down low. Curry and Clay, the Splash Brother, in the backcourt. And it's Robinson in at the small forward. So that's the group out there for Golden State. Nice shot by Thompson. Thompson's got the first points of the third quarter up on the board for the Warriors. Curry surveying the D. Here's Millsap. Warriors with the rebound. Now Thompson. Thompson is double. Green and Green slams it in. He doesn't know the meaning of a soft finish. Draymond's all he's going to throw it down. Harris outside. Pass to Millsap. Now Jokic. Jokic draws the double. Harris outside. Six on the shot clock. But well, Nuggets need to get a shot off here. And they turn over the 24-second buzzer, signaling the shot clock violation. Morris is checked in for Jamal Murray. Stein passes to Kirk. Thompson outside. Goes up on the wing. Warriors getting another chance here. The shot by Cauley Stein. No good. The Nuggets trail by five. Martin surveying the floor. And the pass to Jokic. And there's the bucket. Stay with it on the offensive glass, getting it done. Jokic has got 13 points. Warriors leading by three. And Thompson kicks to Cauley Stein. Here's Curry. Hits the jumper in space. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. Pass to Jokic. Here's Millsap. And he gets the friendly spin, and that one drops. He's got seven. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Uh, we see this all too often. You have to be willing to put it in. Timeout called the Warriors. And team strategies closely guarded. One aspect of the game the fans aren't always privy to. Yeah, and, and sometimes, Greg, it's the most subtle moves that make the biggest difference. Changes here for the Warriors. Looney comes in for Willie Cauley Stein, and it's Russell in for Robinson. And Denver with a change here, too. Porter's checked in. Now here's Curry. He's got 22. Looney kicks to Thompson. Four on the clock. Oaks one up. Rebound by the Nuggets. Jokic has got seven rebounds in the game. To the middle, and Millsap slams it in. Fundamentals, guys, using the one-hand slam. Really makes the basics look pretty exceptional. Outside Curry, over Harris, and the Warriors miss again. Nuggets trail. Guy is a potent offense right now. You know what, guys? And they're playing with a certain amount of assuredness in their game. That type of confidence is what leads teams to having success. Alfonso McKinney is checked in for Golden State. Alec Burks comes in for Steph Curry. The Nuggets also changing it up. Plumley is checked in for Jokic. Grant comes in for Paul Milson. And it's Malik Beasley in for Harris. Denver's gone 3-6 tonight when they've let it fly from downtown. On the wing, Morris. And here's Porter. Passes to Plumley. Morris right side. Beasley for three. Green with the rebound. Green's got his fifth rebound in this one. To the paint. He kicks to Burks. Misses the three. 
And so it's Porter bringing it up now for Denver. Their defense has only allowed six points in the second half. Warriors have gone three of eight so far in the third quarter, looking to lock in that rhythm. Count the basket. Burks has got five now. Using outstanding floor awareness there. Russell's ability to pick apart the defense and find the open man. Now here's Porter. Baseline J on the way. Out to Morris for the tie. Offensive rebound. How about the determination? Now that's what we call competing for a rebound. Burks' shot is good. Seven points in the game. But he's not going to back off when he's down I and mean, when he's got a chance to attack the basket. One oh six left in the third. Beasley, the pass to Porter. The shot, no good. I hate to say it, but he's dragging him down. Not a single bucket. This game. Good on the bucket, and the Warriors lead by seven. And creating a little separation here, gaining some confidence. Yeah, it feels like they're just one step ahead right now, looking to build out their advantage even further. Now, here is Morris. Seven points in the game. Beasley for three. It's hauled in by McKinney. McKinney's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. The Nuggets trail by seven. Morris passes the ground. Plumley with it. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. It's good. Now, here is Russell. From deep three-point range, and that one released in time, but no good. The third quarter comes to a close. The Warriors on top, up by five. Live from Chase Center, you're watching 2K Sports. Here now a chance to show you our assist of the game. And it's presented, as always, by State Farm. And, and I'm glad this was the pick because I love this pass. Such a great dish. That's what I call court vision. But it's also called making a good read, understanding where everyone is and taking full advantage. Fantastic. NBA playoffs round one. Thanks for joining us as we get back to the action on the court. So out there for the Nuggets right now. We've got Beasley. Grant is out there with Will Barton. Then it's Plumley and it's Murray in at the point guard. They get the rebound. Holly Stein. Plumley with some nice D. The Nuggets trail by five. Here's Barton. Sweet little floater. Barton's got his first bucket of the night. <laughs> that's just great touch. The teardrop, well, that's all about fear. Russell dishes to Thompson. Fires the three. Good, and it's Russell picking up the assist. Russell's got his fifth assist in this one. Oh, the green light doesn't get any brighter than it is for Thompson. And when the three is there for him, he'll take it. Now here's Murray. Let's it go from 11, and that one hits back iron. Thompson passes to Russell. He doesn't hit that one. Now the Nuggets take it the other way. Now he hasn't chipped in with many points tonight. The good thing he has the guys around him to carry the weight. And the confidence from Murray, just so efficient from the interior. Now a timeout called by Golden State.
Stephen Curry's checked in for Russell. The Nuggets also changing it up. Jokic, he's checked in for Plumlee. Millsap comes in for Grant, and Harris subbed in for Beasley. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with David Aldridge. Hey, guys. Well, Steve Kerr talked to his team during the last timeout. He's encouraged where they are at this point in the game, but he told his guys things can turn in a blink. What we need to do is execute the rest of the way. So we'll see if they can finish this one off, Kevin. Here's Murray after the main shot from Clay Thompson. Millsap looking it over. Just five on the clock. Martin the bounce pass. Jokic, no good. Solid rebound there, and with the score like it is, that's an area where they can't afford to get lazy. Well, you don't see that very well. A wide open three is usually like a layup for him. Better to be lucky than good. Got that shot to fall. Warriors leading by four. Here's Curry. Unable to get that one. Good work defensively by Millsap. Harris kicks to Barton. Pass to Jokic. Over Robinson. And it's Jokic missing. Warriors have gone two of seven from the field in what's been a cold start to the fourth quarter for them. Robinson dishes to Curry. There's the pass to Cauley Stock. Let's it go from 14. And there's Stephen Curry on the assist from Cauley Stock. He's used to creating for himself. This time, Curry is a great decoy. He's a recipient of a good pass. I mean, that, that's a great teamwork. Now here's Murray. Here's Jokic. The Warriors pull it in. Cauley Stein's got his sixth rebound on the night, and Curry has it in the corner. Sinks the three-pointer. And now it's a nine-point Warrior lead. Oh, man. This game is so beautiful. It's a joy to watch. Curry, when he's at the top of his game like this, crazy. Back to Barton. Right side, Millsap. Amon Green with the rebound. And it's Thompson with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Golden State Warriors. They lead by their biggest margin of the game. Nine. That's his first personal foul. At the line for your Warriors, Glenn Robinson, the third. Two shots. Two. Two. First free throw is good, and that'll push the lead to double digits. Robinson hits them both. Denver calls timeout. They're trailing by 11. 157 left here in the fourth quarter. Jordan player of the game, Steph Curry. And guys, he's been about as close to perfection as you can be. The intensity he's played with has been amazing. Just no let up. And as fired up as he's been, he's never let his emotions get out of control. Some players rise to the occasion in the playoff spotlight, and some wilt under it. We know which type he is. What a stunning night for him. Now here's Murray. A fader. That one's in there. The Warrior lead has got down to nine in the bucket from Nikola Jokic. He must have a real good feel for the fader. I mean, he uses it even when no one's on him. Her. The offensive rebound. And the shot goes in. Oh, man. The relentless pursuit of the basketball by Kali Stein. Just a tremendous hustle on the offensive glass. Martin passes to Jokic. No good, and he's missed half of his 14 field goal attempts. Pass to Kirby. And out of bounds as the Nuggets gain possession. There's 117 left in the fourth quarter. Inside. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. He's been as dependable as he always is. He can't do it all by himself. Six 
Free throw. Good. Jokic. 109 left in the game. Murray against Kerr. A floater, and he lays it up and in. And the Warriors lead by 10. And guys, that's going to wrap it up. Fans are piling out the exits. Obviously a huge win here in game two for the Warriors. And the big difference here was accuracy from three-point range. Yeah, and once they started sinking shots, it really stretched out to be and created other opportunities. And anytime they got space, they seemed to just knock down another triple. The one player that really stands out, of course, in this one, it was a dazzling game for Steph Curry. I mean, he had a plan for how to attack the deep. He executed and never let up. Relentless offensive basketball. And you can sense that these fans... These players, they are ready to celebrate. You know they are, sure. I mean, come on, the finish line is in sight. All they have to do is play it smart. Oh, how about the deft touch right there, guys? He just guided that ball back up and in. Just a fingertip touch on the ball. So we see the Warriors taking the game here. And this win puts them squarely in the driver's seat in this series. Up now, break two zip with all the momentum on their side. I mean, in fantastic shape right now. If they can capitalize on this victory and win game three, you can just about put this series to bed. You got it. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Kevin, thanks a lot. Clay, what was the key to the win tonight? Just do it as a team. You know, it's not an individual effort. We're a real deep team this year. We got uh, a lot of guys who would start on some good teams, so we just did it collectively. Play great effort from everyone. Thanks again. Back to you, Kevin. Thank you, David. Great interview once again. And that about wraps it up, folks. We hope you've enjoyed our broadcast of the NBA Western Conference quarterfinals. For Chris Weber, Greg Anthony, and David Alders, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.